ChatGPT planned out my Friday for me and it did not disappoint. Here's the prompt I gave it. If you want to use it, you can find it in my description box below. The sun is coming up. Chat GPT didn't tell me to brush my teeth. I always brush my teeth before I leave the house. I'm kind of uncomfortable with not having my teeth brushed. fast until 12 p.m. but chat GBT told me to eat at 8 a.m. and don't mind if I do and fun fact I have never cooked spinach with eggs before so I'm kind of excited to try it out and see if the hype is real fun little tip if you're cutting onions and you don't want your eyes to get watery put the knife under water first and then cut it whatever fumes makes your eyes get watery gets like soaked up by the water or something I don't know what happens but it works for me maybe it'll work for you as well Okay, I have like a good amount of time to eat before I start work. Mmm. Mmm. Absolutely. Chat GBT didn't mention this part, <coughs> but I do need to take a shower because I do not want to work in sweaty clothes. I'll be back in T minus two seconds or like 10 minutes. A few moments later. It is officially time for my break. That egg toast filled me up, but I am starving. According to my day plan, I am eating some grilled chicken and some greens with balsamic vinaigrette. Let's make some of this. The one thing I'm not gonna eat in here though is these tomatoes. You can eat them. Doesn't it blow your mind sometimes how our technology has come and the thing about AI that gets me is this is the worst it's gonna be it's only gonna get better if you told me two years ago that I can get artificial intelligence to plan out my day to a T even better than I can I would say you're lying and look at me now this is about to taste so good This is the spiciest salad I've ever eaten. It's 12.31, so it is time to go back to work. It's just something really nice about something apart from yourself planning out your day and you just following it. I guess this is the point of having an assistant. That being said, back to work. It's 3.30, which means it's time to tidy up the place. officially done work it is currently 5 p.m i have i guess an hour to prepare dinner because at six o'clock it wants me to eat which is crazy because i eat dinner at like 9 p.m i know that's really late but i heard eating dinner earlier is better so i'll go and try it out for dinner i'm having baked salmon with roasted vegetables i'm not gonna roast the vegetables i'm gonna fry them i'm gonna do like a stir fry i have like the pack of salmon 
that has been thawed out. So I'm gonna get them on a sheet. For the vegetables, I'm doing some broccoli, red peppers, potatoes. I've had everything here before. The only things I haven't had, funny enough, is the mini potatoes. It's currently 6.30. I was supposed to start eating at 6 o'clock, but these potatoes took forever. But it's time for the moment of truth. This is what it looks like. We have some potatoes, we have some salmon, and we have some broccoli and red pepper. For the last time today, according to ChatGPT, let me eat and see what this food is like. Mmm, I seasoned this well. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It took me forever to cook this. I started at like 4.30 and I'm just finishing. Two hours! And I can't even tell you what took two hours. I just did. That was a great meal. It's hard to even pick my favorite meal. They were all 10 out of 10s. Spinach and egg on avocado on toast. Fantastic. The mixed greens with strawberries in there and chicken and the balsamic vinaigrette. Excellent. Potatoes mixed with red pepper and broccoli and salmon. Stupendous. The dinner's over, so it's time to go pack.